Hey everyone, this is Alex or Polymomo T, and today I have a video showing you how to make this cute little snail with a little galaxy flowery shell out of polymer clay and resin. So first we're going to make the template for the shell, so I'm taking some scrap clay and I'm rolling it into a thin snake. Then I'm going to cut the end of the snake and then I'm going to roll it into a spiral. And then I'm going to cut off the excess, making the shell flat. And when it's baked according to instructions, I made a little mold out of it using some silicone mold maker. So for the shell, I put in some UV resin, along with some colored pigments. So I used purple. Blue. and pink. And here are some flowers I got from Miniature Sweets and I decided to add these into the shells. And I also decided to add a little bit of glitter. You can never forget the glitter. So I poured in the blue resin into the mold about a third of the way. Added some flowers. Then I added some more pink resin onto the blue and added some more flowers again. I added some purple resin this time along with more flowers again. And I topped it off with some more UV resin. And to have a more blended galaxy look, I just put in a little wooden stick and I mixed in the resin all together. And I just did some swirling around and lifting. Then I cured it under the UV lamp for two minutes and I took it out of the mold. And I really like how it turned out. I think even in the matte design, it looks really nice. So for the snail head or body, the part that looks like a slug, I'm taking a ball of pro clay and I'm rolling it on one side, leaving a ball for the head and then a snake for the tail. And then I flattened out the tail part and made sure that the shell fit on top of it nicely. And of course, we can't forget the signature dot eyes and a line smile. And once completed, you want to bake it in the oven according to the polymer clay instructions. So once it's fully baked, we're going to add some super glue onto our shell and we're going to attach it to our polymer clay body and let it dry. And this is an optional step, but I'm taking some UV resin and a paintbrush and I'm kind of giving a layer of glaze just to give it some extra shine. And especially for the resin part, it's going to make it super shiny and you can see the flowers much better. And you're going to want to cure that under the UV lamp for another two minutes. And once fully cured, you have your finished snail. And here's the finished snail. I really like how it came out. I think the galaxy floral design came out really nicely and it's much better than I expected it to. And the little flowers do really look nicely in the galaxy. I didn't think that they would pop. So I'm very surprised that you can actually see them pretty well. And I think it's because it's a spiral. You can kind of see it magnified on one side and it's kind of smaller on the other, which I think makes it look so much better. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know what you want to see for my next videos. And if you had a snail that you could put anything in shell, what would you put in it? Put that in the comment section below. Thank you!